Hi Aquarius, how are you? Um, see the bird? Uh, let's see, it is like 8.30 at night and almost 90 degrees. So, I'm a little sweaty. But I wanted to get you guys in. I had to come to a different area for Capricorn and very peaceful it's very pretty it's very nice here no water sorry you guys did have a flipper the light keeps changing doesn't it this is for Aquarius Sun Moon and rising Venus and wherever else you want to put it um, for the week of July 30th Let's see this came out and your energy, I don't know if I'm talking to the same, I must be getting in the light there. Um, I don't know if I'm talking to the same Aquarius as I was before, but oh my God, your energy feels so good. It feels so happy. It feels so light. It feels joyous. And you had the star come out. Happy times make positive, optimistic, long-term plans on the right path. You're on the right path, and it's time to be very op optimistic about things. So, mm, maybe I am talking to the same group, but you guys are just getting a handle on yourself now, huh? Balancing things out. Got some things planned. Moving forward. Yes, yes. Love it, but you're still holding on to something. Still holding on to something, you're not making the changes in your physical environment that you should be. For the Aquarius that I am connecting with, you know if I'm talking to you. All right? You know if I'm talking to you. You're working on it. You're working on something. What are you working on? Making a decision. What's the decision about? Oh, how to not feel like this anymore? Oh, you want a new start. You want passion. You want forward movement. Aquarius, you, are you feeling randy, Aquarius? Are you? <laughs> if you don't know the movie, never mind. But that's going to lead you to some victories. Take that energy. You're getting a bolt of energy take that energy to move you forward knight of wands with the world yes 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 take that energy that and the world won't come out of my hand it's going to bring you into better alliance alliance what's the word alliance alignment with your higher self your heart and your mind it's going to help you make a decision. Sorry about the lighting, guys. It's going in and out pretty bad. Maybe if I don't hold the card up to the camera so close. Okay, what else do we have for Aquarius? What's going on for Aquarius for the week of July 30th, please? Page of Cups, Judgment, Two of Wands. You guys have to make a decision Possibly about a Pisces hangman. Um, feeling a little defensive. You guys have to make a decision about this new start. This offer that's coming in. I don't think it's a new offer. The lovers make a decision. Gemini energy. King of Wands. Could be a fire sign. And we have the hangman again. Pisces. With... The King of Cups, water. Ooh, yeah, 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 yeah. You need to get a different perspective about how you feel about your foundation. That's exactly what it is. You need what, what's trying to come out? The Three of Wands. And you need to move. You need action. You need to take action. You need to make a decision about your foundation. What you want to do? What do you want to do? What do you want to do? All right, Aquarius. What is. What else do we have for Aquarius? 
king of pentacles your stability this is all about your stability ace of wands again <clears throat> and the empress what's going to lead to your abundance and your happiness i don't know let's find out what do we have for aquarius for the week of july Ooh, a couple three flippers first we have Two of Swords, the Empress, and the Knight of Cups. You have to make you have to make a decision on what's going to make you happy. You need to make a decision and take action on what's going to make you happy. You have this new energy coming in. It's refreshing. Um, use it. Use it, King of Swords. Use it to cut out what you don't want. Seven of Pentacles. Instead of looking at what you don't want, use it to cut it out so that you can have much better results in everything that you're trying to achieve. Walk away from that which is not serving you and cut it out. I can't make that up if I tried. Couldn't make it up if I tried. Get help. Get help if you need it. Okay, get help. It is there for you. No, 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 no. Not that kind of help. That's the wrong help, Aquarius. We're trying to get over this, remember? We're trying to get over this. No, I take that back. We're trying to find happiness while in this. We're trying to find stability without negating the fact that you guys, it is, you, it is the same group, trying to find some happiness in the chaos. That's what I'm getting. In the heartbreak. Feeling defensive over the past is not going to help, but you are going to heal at your own pace. So what do we have for Aquarius that would be helpful? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I was told, well, take a different deck. You gotta love spirit, right? All right. Justice. Fair and just decisions. Do what you know is right. Stand up for your beliefs. Knight of Earth. Time to buckle down and get things done. Honor your commitments. A guardian angel. You are being watched and protected, but you need to buckle down and get things done. I remember you guys had this in your reading. Your reading was all about this, um, what, two weeks ago? Check it out. Hold on. Let me see if I can show you. Uh, where is it? There it is, the moon. It looks really tiny on the screen, though. Okay. It's time to get things done. Time to move. Time. That's what's going. Oh, Aquarius. Now I get it. Instead of sitting there and wallowing, that's not going to help you any at all. Take this jolt of energy that you have and put it to good use to get some things done. All right. Three of air. Great sadness. Take time to heal. The need to forgive yourself and others you're not going to magically come out of this okay Aquarius it's it's not gonna magically go away night of water falling in love or wedding proposals the need to balance emotions an invitation to a social event you need to balance your emotions now and you may get an invitation to go out Nine of air, expecting the worst, self-fulfilling prophecies, sleepless nights. This is what we need to combat. How do we combat this? We wear ourselves out physically if we need to. <clears throat> okay, let's go to the other deck. Can you guys hear all the cicadas and birds? Aquarius for the week of July 30th. 
What other advice do you have for Aquarius? I made one video um, before I started it though. I felt like it was for both Capricorn and Aquarius. So it's under Capricorn Aquarius bonus. You may want to watch that one. Aquarius. There we go. Ace of Winter. Don't be deterred by challenges along the way. It is important to communicate clearly and accurately amazing new ideas that should be implemented. Communicate your needs. You're worth communicating your needs for, okay? You're capable. The Emperor, use logic and structure to increase your success. Get organized. A firm but compassionate leader. Okay, so you guys still need to get organized. You still need to get moving. But I know that you can do this. I know that you're sad. I know that your heart broke. All right? The best way to stop swimming in those dark emotions is to do something. Do something to take your mind off of what's been causing you pain. It's not going to heal it, but it's going to bring you some relief. Okay? Last one. Seven of Summer. Oh, my God. No more procrastinating with an exclamation point. Your power comes from making a decision. Confusion that arises from overanalyzing the options. I think you're just overanalyzing. I think you're caught in a loop is what I think. I think you're caught in a loop in your head. And if that's the case, you need to do something to break that. Okay, Aquarius, that's all I have for you. You know I love you and I'm thinking about you. I will see you guys soon. Peace to you. Ciao. Bye.